So this is how it is, right, guys? And I'm going to, I want you to listen, yeah? Because this is from the bottom of my heart, yeah? I do really care about you. Everyone knows that, right? Even if you refuse to believe that, right? What I did, yeah, was stupid, right? But you've done things that are way worse when we were together, yeah? And I forgave you time and time again. But then you always see it as, you know, that, it's, that everything's my fault, you know? That everything I do is wrong, you know? And to be quite fair, I feel like you're being selfish and self-centered a bit because I chose to come down last night to give you cigarettes, yeah? I didn't have to. That was my decision. But, you know, a bit of appreciation. Like, oh, thank you. That's very nice of you. You didn't have to do that. Do you know what I mean? That's what most people would have done, Kez. You know, I, I like to help people, yeah? Especially people like you that I really, really love and care about. And I just wish that you understood that. And like I said, it's okay for you to make mistakes, but as soon as I make one slight mistake, that's it. It's it's over, do you know what I mean? And I can't get my head around that, you know? And especially after what happened to you, Kez, I am worried about you. You're not the same person that I used to know. We used to lay in, no, sit in the park, you know, on the bench together, and you used to cuddle up to me, and we used to look at the squirrels, yeah? It just feels like you're not there anymore. You know, it's like you're somewhere else. And I think there's something else that's going on that you're not telling me. Because I've had my suspicions about certain things, and I will discuss that another time. But something don't seem to add up. Because it ain't just what I did. There's no fucking way. Not a chance. But, yeah. I just thought I'd make this video for you, alright? And tell you how it is and how I see it. Okay? Because... I, you just don't get it, you know, how much I'm willing to go for you, you know, after when you was raped, right, not that I want to bring that up again, because that fucking tortures me as well, I know it affects you, but it affects, it, it affected me as well, but not as much as it affected you, obviously, but I took you in to stay with me for a few nights, yeah, just to get away so I could look after you, and I did that, you know, now, if I didn't give a shit, even though you've said some nasty things to me the other night, when you turned around and said you wish me dead, all this stuff, and, you know, that I'm this, and I'm going to shag someone else, that's what you were saying, do you know what I mean? I'm going to invite Steve down there. It's, you know, you're just choosing to be malicious to me and, and being vicious. There's no need for that kind of behavior. Now, I don't say them things to you. And yes, a couple about a month ago, almost, no, um, a few weeks back, yeah, I did call you a slag, right? But I apologise time and time again. I have texts to prove that. And I said to you the reasons why I called you that. Yeah, because your history, right, of when you were you know, younger and used to sell yourself, yeah? But I know you don't do that anymore. But it's just, to me, feels like that, you know, you won't forgive me for that. Even though I said to you that I'm sorry numerous times. But, you know, I just don't know what went wrong, Kez. Honestly, I really don't, sweetheart, you know? But... You know, it's your choice, yeah? But I will say goodbye before you leave the country. All right? But, yeah. Just remember that, you know, that Valentine's thing was, to me, was the most special day of my life. Because nobody's ever done that. To see you out there happy. It's like I'm there, but I'm not. You know? In that moment. I picture the hot tub still. I picture you there, in there, smiling at me. Hmm. yeah okay you may have fucked me up mentally from what you put me through but I still stuck by you because I chose to because that's how far I'm willing to go to care for someone that I love and nothing can change that anyway hopefully you'll get this